Hey everyone, my name is Lovestar, welcome back to my fairy core let's play and today is Friday so I'm gonna be doing a face cam and I hope you guys are having an amazing Friday fun day fry -yay, as I like to call it. Um, like a freaking loser, <laughs> I'm just kidding. Um, but it is a Friday, I hope. Um, so I'm really excited to be playing fairy core today and I wanted to actually make some progress on the tea house, well the coffee tea house, and oh my gosh, guys, I'm so excited because first of all, we're gonna have to actually decorate the inside, and I need to also fix the pathway here, but we can also start working on our actual tea and coffee making, which is something I've been looking forward to doing for so long. I've been dying to get into the tea and coffee mods of this mod pack for literally ages. So before we get into all that, I think what we need to do just to make this a little bit easier for ourselves is to actually create the pathway. Just get the, you know, the less fun part out of the way. And I think, oh my god, wait, this is way too loud. Sorry, I hate how loud breaking grass is. Um, yeah, we should also probably talk to Marquita. And I do have a name for the cat that we gave her. It's such a cute name, oh my gosh. So once we actually go over there, since we're slowly making our way back to the farm area, I will get um, the name. I'll get. I'll have to make a collar tag for the cat. We can also say hi to Marquita, so hopefully she's there. And yeah, so <laughs> I, I love doing my face cams, but oh my gosh, guys, I'm currently like growing out my hair because I want to like recut it and I'm not cutting my bangs for a while and they're getting so long. You can probably tell like they're literally like all up in my eyes, um, <laughs> but I really like how I look with bangs. So I'm not just gonna, I'm not gonna like move them out of the way. Um, because it looks always a little bit silly, just like random bangs like on the side of your face. Anyway. Yeah, but it's just annoying because <laughs> I can't cut them, but I really want to because they're getting so long. But yeah, I just wanted to mention that because, oh my gosh, it's really annoying. <laughs> but yeah, so I'm just trying to grow out my hair so I can kind of like fix it because, yeah, I'm like in the process of kind of just like figuring out how to take care of my hair, which has always been kind of an, uh, a puzzle to me because I have a very bizarre hair texture. Uh, but anyway, so let's see. Okay, so I, the cat is here. The cat is here, but Marquita is not. I'm just gonna put some of this stuff away. Oh, I need to put down this lotus actually. So, what can I just throw in here? I'll probably just put this stuff. I could just put it in my backpack, but honestly, I don't know why, why didn't I think of doing that. Ugh. <laughs> it's been a while. It's been a while. So, yeah, I'm working on. Okay, another random thought. Sorry, I'm just all over the place right now, but I'm working on so many different videos right now for you guys, and I'm so excited to show you them. First of all, the next mermaid episode is going to be so awesome. You guys are going to love it, especially since I know that a lot of you guys really enjoy watching me build and all of the more like creative fun, like the creative videos that I do. Um, I think you guys really do enjoy them and that's great because I do enjoy it too. But yeah, the next mermaid episode is definitely going to involve a lot of that. So yeah, no more spoilers, but I'm really excited to get that video out for you guys. Um, I'm working really hard to get the mermaid episodes out for you guys. I try to do them by, wait, what's it's like every two weeks, yeah, which I know is kind of like, uh, it's kind of a wait, but you know, they take me a long time and I want to make sure that they're good. Like, I don't want to rush rush through them. So yeah, I really try to give myself enough time to get them done. But yeah, and um, the next one, I'm like so, I'm, I'm so excited for the next one. Another thing that I'm working on is actually going to be a build tutorial. So I've not, I've not actually done any build tutorials before, but I have this amazing little build for you guys that I know you're gonna love, especially if you're a fan of my mermaid series. And no, it's not gonna be the mermaid castle. It's actually gonna be something completely new. Like it's not in my mermaid series, but it's definitely inspired by my mermaid series. And I'm so excited. I just wanted to tell you guys because I just, uh, I can't keep all the secrets in. Like I have to give you at least this little tiny sneak peek. But yeah, um, okay, so we actually need to put down this fish. Or maybe I can just, uh, well, first of all, I need some cobblestone. Wow, do I really not have any cobblestone? What the heck? Oh god, that is not good. How am I out of cobblestone? Okay, well, first of all, let me put down this fish somewhere. Um, maybe he can just chill here for now. <laughs> he can be our little rice fish, because he's in the rice 
field or whatever. Um, okay, so there's these things we need to place down. I'm just trying to clear out a little bit of space. I Oh my god, I'm going to have to get some more cobblestone. I did not realize I was running out. That is so bad. Okay, well, we have some mossy cobblestone here. I'm just going to place. Because why not? So I'm going to probably start the pathway here. And... I, I guess I should also place some slabs, but kind of don't have any of those. Um, wow, we're only missing a few blocks here, but we definitely do need to get some cobblestone. Okay, well, let me go up here, place down these lily pads, and then we can try to find some. Where's- okay, here. This pretty lotus! Oh, oh my gosh, no! No! Don't do that! Oh my god, I feel like that fish is gonna get himself killed. That is so bad. Um, okay, well, I... I don't wanna, like... <laughs> I don't wanna get rid of the, um... The lily pads. <sighs> Dang it! Stupid fish. Okay, let me, let me try to find some stone. Should I just... Take this? I don't know, because I want regular cobblestone. Not the mossy stuff. Um, I totally forgot to name the cat when I went over there, but I'll do that in a second. What is this? This is like a little cave. Ooh, there's a lot of coal in here. I could totally use some of this. Oh, this leads into the crystal cave, actually, which is pretty interesting. Okay, well, I'm not going to spend any ridiculous amount of time getting cobblestone. I only need a little bit, so this is, this is probably enough. So let's go back so we can get this path done with. Um, there was another one I wanted to make that connects the lush or the crystal cave to the main house area, but don't really want to do that right now. There's actually a few things that I've been meaning to do off camera. I just haven't had the time, um, but that's definitely one of them because I don't want to do too many paths. It's just kind of boring. Um, but yeah, so I also need to still make the bubble elevator in the Twilight Tree House. I know I've been saying that already for like the past five or six episodes, but I keep forgetting. Um, I just don't really have the time to play on this world in my free time. But I really should get on to that. But anyway. Okay, so there's the pathway. Now, um, is this sun going to set soon? I think it is. So hopefully Marquita will come home. Oh my gosh, I'm always worried about her now. Maybe I should just uh, trap her in her house. <laughs> That's horrible. Um, maybe we shouldn't do that. I feel like we would get the police called on us. Um, but I'm going to go over to the storage room and I'm going to make myself a collar tag so we can name the new cat. And if only Marquita was here to see it. Actually, I'm going to grab Melody really quick. I think she's in her house. I don't know why, but I feel like I just need her around. Oh, she's not in here. Oh, where is she? Is she still the sheeps? I think she is. Melody! There you are. I'm sorry, I left you here. <laughs> I completely forgot about you! Oh my gosh, she's been going crazy with the wool collecting. Okay, hi Melody. Let's get you out of here. I'm sorry for overworking you. Um, okay, you're free. You're free now from your t chores. Okay, so she's gonna follow us around for a little bit. Um, we're gonna grab this. Oh, I, I totally forgot to replace this soul gem. Okay, and now we need some copper. And let's make the collar tag. And we're gonna name the cat Jam! So, um, I wanted something a little bit, you know, strawberry or pink themed. And Jam, you know, is probably short for strawberry jam. So, yes, the cat is gonna be called Jam. But I loved... Oh my god, there were so many good suggestions that I saw. Some of them was like Ichigo, which is strawberry in Japanese, which is such a cute name. Uh, good morning, Melody! Wait, it's morning? Oh, oops! Wait, I set this to false. I meant to set it to true. Okay, the time wasn't changing. Whoops! My bad. I think I typed the wrong command. Anyway. So, <laughs> the time has not been passing for the past, like, what, five minutes? Uh, oopsie whoopsie. Um, okay, where the hell is Marquita? Marquita? Oh god, is she at the village? Where is she? I'm actually getting really nervous. I think I'm just gonna make her stay inside the house. Um, while we're out here looking for her, 
Um, what I'm gonna do is actually- Okay, so I've been wanting to go on a little adventure. Um, I guess Melody can come with us because we're not- We're gonna be able to put her in her- In her soul- What's it called? Soul spell. And- Okay, I totally forgot to clear my inventory. I'm just gonna drop this in- Ah! Oh, my gosh, my backpack is already getting crazy here. Um, I will clean it. I swear I will, eventually. <laughs> but- I need to find Marquita and then- okay, so yeah, as I was saying, I want to go on a little adventure to look for butterflies and for, um, we need to find tea and coffee and like all that stuff. So, first I really want to find Marquita. I'm actually nervous. I'm actually really nervous. Where could she be? Oh, there you are. Oh my gosh. Okay, so she's here actually where I saw her last, I think. Okay, so we're just gonna talk with her a little bit. Oh, she does not want to talk, apparently. Um, one more? Okay, she liked that. So let me see. We still have 359 hearts. What the hell? That is crazy. I feel like we should probably just, like, give her the, um, the bouquet to start the relationship. Um, just so she doesn't, like, marry anyone. <laughs> um, that is a possibility. So let me see. How do you even make this? Ooh. Oh, we just need any flower. Okay, so that's pretty easy. I guess we'll look for some flowers while we're doing this. So I put Melody in my soul spell so we can just explore a little bit. Um, but let's, let's go look around. I think I might go maybe this way. And we're just gonna see what we find. I want to kind of just, like... Just, like, look around and explore new things. Also, I added a new mod, um, a while ago. Yeah, I think I just forgot to mention it last episode. But I added the tarot cards mod, which is actually someone suggested that I add it, and I did. Because it's, I mean, yeah, that fits perfectly into Fairy Core, I believe. Um, I've never used tarot cards. I, uh, what the hell? <laughs> I sound like I had a British accent. I never used tarot cards before. But, um... I guess I'm willing to try it out in Minecraft, right? <laughs> Why not? Okay, so let's see. Um, wow, this place- oh my god, this is so pretty. Like this, uh, wow, oh my god. I love this place, look at this. Wow, this is so pretty, oh my gosh. I would totally make a house here. <sighs> wow. Oh man, this is so beautiful. I love these two biomes together. Very pretty. Oh my god, guys. I'm so amazed. I just- ugh, I love this freaking terrain right here. Oh my god, this place is so pretty too. Wow, there's a um, mushroom house up there. And a dark oak forest. Okay, so I think I'm gonna actually get off my broom now so we can let the, uh, the chunks load. Because they're being a little bit slow. Um, so I need to find some flowers too. There's a lily of the valley here. I think we can use that. We only need five. Um, one, two, three, four, five. Perfect. So now, uh, if I have my- where's my wood? Let me make myself a crafting table. Oh my god. There we go. Jesus. <laughs> and let's see if we can make a bouquet. This does not count as a small flower. Oh wait, I did I did it upside down. I'm an idiot. Okay, there we go. So we have a bouquet. So we're gonna give this to Marquita when we come home. Um, because apparently she really likes me and I'm just gonna, you know what, I'm just gonna secure the relationship. Why not? I was gonna take things a little bit slow with her and just try to build up the relationship. And not like rush through it. But apparently like... We're just cool. Like, we're just cool like that. She likes us. So I'm just gonna go for it. I'm gonna go for the bouquet and we're gonna start a little relationship. Um, but then we need to still, like, in like what's the word? Propose and, like, get engaged and then marry. So there's still a few more steps into the process, but I'm really excited. And, I mean, she's still gonna live in her house, but she's basically my next door neighbor. So, yeah. Pretty, pretty awesome. And, um... I'm still looking for some butterflies. Man, I don't know why, like, ugh, they're so, so rare in this world. I swear they're supposed to be spawning more often than they do. 
It's kind of weird. Kind of weird. But yeah, so I'm also going to have to try to find some tea leaves. Oh, this is a uh, inventory pets. <gasps> Jukebox! Ah, oh, that's awesome. Wait. Play disc in inventories. Oh, cool. Oh my gosh, that's so, that's so awesome. We can actually have a little portable music player. <laughs> okay, that'll be fun. I'll have to use my discs that I have at home. But yeah, so what I was saying is we're going to have to try to find some tea, tea bushes or whatever. The little tea plants, which I think are found in swamp biomes. Um, oh, ferrets! Wait... I have three. Oh wait, no, they eat raw rabbit. Never mind, never mind. Why do I have chicken on me then? Whatever. Um, so, oh, oh wow, look at this. There's, uh, hello? Shebas. Interesting. Well, I'm not a big dog person, so I'm not gonna really get those. Um, yeah, so we're gonna, okay, you know what? I'm gonna sleep. And what I was gonna say is we need to find some tea leaves and also coffee coffee plants from the kawaii dishes mod i think there's also let's see farmer's respite how do you respite right what am i what am i getting wrong here hello farmer's respite yeah why is that not showing up that's weird respite there we go okay so there is black tea leaves Green tea leaves, yellow tea leaves, tea seeds, coffee beans, coffee berries. Okay, I'm not really sure how to get all of those, but I'm looking for the tea seeds. And they they have coffee beans too that we're going to have to find. So we're going to go on a little hunt for these things. I actually think I have tea leaves in my kitchen. However, I'm just going to go out there and look anyway because we do need some of the other stuff too. There's also coffee beans from the kawaii, kawaii dishes mod as I just mentioned. Which I'm going to find those, but those are everywhere. Like, they're literally where my house is too. Look at that little water. <laughs> Cute! Those are um, literally where my house is, but I'm going to try to see if I can find any more. So... Okay, I'm gonna look around a little bit and see if I can find anything. Okay guys, so I'm in the swamp that I think is actually close to my house. Um, however, I'm really scared of swamps because of those guys and those guys. The sirens and I don't even remember what these are called. But I'm really scared of them because they're pretty strong. Um, so I'm just gonna stay in the air. Unless we find something. Actually, I think that's the tea. That's the tea. <laughs> I'm sorry. That is a tea plant, isn't it? Oh my god, they're already shooting me. Jesus. Okay, see, this is what I was afraid of. Um. So first of all- Oh my god, wait, they're gonna break my room. Where's my quiver pet? Can you not- Can you not hit me? Dude, how are- You guys have aimbot. Look at this. This is ridiculous. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna... I'm gonna see if I can grab some tea from another place. But I'm actually gonna get off my broom. Because, uh, they're probably just gonna break it. Um, so what is this? Oh no, that's mugwort. That's not even... I don't think I was looking at a tea plant. Well, this sucks. Okay, first of all, I'm gonna take out my self-heal. Just in case they wreck my ass. Um, so this is not... <laughs> That's not tea at all. I was completely mistaken. This is all just hexeray stuff. It's kind of interesting how actually all of the hexeray stuff is in the swamp. I didn't even know that. Well, besides the trees. Um, so where are the tea? The tea thingies. Now it's like hard for me to tell. So this is mugwort. Um, okay, this is not looking good. Oh my god, they're still following me. Jesus Christ. Okay, this is really bad. This is really bad. Really bad. I just want some tea. Why are they so aggro? They hate me so much. Oh my god, there's freaking sirens. Okay, I really don't see any. I don't know if it's because I'm just blind or what. Um, but I'm pretty sure there's a whole army of those guys chasing me right now, so that's really nice. I love being chased. 
Yes, I do. It's the best feeling in the world. Oh my gosh, please. I just want some tea. This is a swamp, isn't it? Well, no, it's not actually. It's a highland moor, apparently. Duh! Get away! Get away, I'm slowed. No, no. Do you guys see any tea? I really don't see any. I think this is not actually a swamp. Is this maybe like a hex ray biome? No, it's a biome's a plenty. It's a biome's a plenty biome. I don't understand. What is going on? Okay, well, I don't- I don't know. I guess- Ah, this is not good! Okay, okay, okay. Um, I'm getting on my broom and I'm just getting out of here. Okay. I think I was mistaken. That was definitely not a swamp. Um... But it was full of hexeray stuff and swamp creatures. Like those sirens and those green guys, they are definitely the the mobs that spawn in swamps. Which is why I was a bit confused. Okay. Well, that was a fail. I guess I have to keep looking now. I don't really I haven't seen anything. Oh my god. <gasps> oh no! My brush broke. Crap. Whoa! Oh, that's a jungle temple! Oh my god, wait. Let's go check this out. Um, okay, so this is bad though. My, bre my brush broke. Which means we can't ride our broom anymore. Look at it, it's just a stick. <laughs> that's so silly. Okay, well, I need to see if it's gonna be a full moon soon because I still need to find... Uh, or I still- Oh, little lizard, hello! I still need to make the, um, the moon brush. Oops, wait. Let me do mage lights. Okay, well, I'm just gonna break in here and see- Oh, ow. See what I can find. See if we can get some free arrows. Don't mind if I do. And- Oh, ow. <laughs> One of them went into me. Oh, source gems! Yes! Okay, awesome. I actually really need those. Um, okay, so I still don't really know what all of these things do from Ars Nouveau, but I'm definitely going to take them. My- not the bamboo though, but pretty sick. Let's see if we can find the other chest. Here it is. Ooh, augment arrows. This is a pierce one. Awesome. Aerial biblio. I think I already have that one. Bamboo spikes. I'm not taking that, but I'm taking the iron. Okay, let's see if we can see the moon. Actually, I don't know if we can because it's freaking raining. Rain, no! What moon is it? How do I how do I check the moon? Uh oh wait, the um and the what's it called? It was the 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 crystal ball? The crystal ball, I think <gasps> this will Tell if it's day or night and what phase of the moon cycle it is, if it's night. Okay, we need to make this ASAP. Okay, stone and a diamond. I actually think I have a diamond on me from the loot. Yes. We are going to do this. So, first of all, we need to get home. Um, I'm going to just use my waypoint um, because I don't know how much time we have left. So, let's go over to the toilet forest. Actually, I need a piece of stone really quick. Uh, okay, wow. So, that adventure was a total fail. I didn't find anything. Um, not even the coffee fruit, which is supposed to be really common. So I don't know what's up with that. I guess I just got really unlucky. And of course, I don't have any stone. Great. But, but, we can just use our attack spell. I mean, our, our break spell. I cannot freaking speak today. Okay, so problem solved, basically. I don't, I don't really think we need to smell any stone. We can just break some. So if I find any, there should be some... On top of the stairwell, actually. So, yeah, this place I've never really plucked or plugged. Ah, creeper! Ah! Okay. <laughs> Crisis averted. Alright, let me go to the Twilight Tree House and we can do a little bit of witchcraft and see what cycle of the moon it is. I am actually really excited. Actually, I think I already have a crystal ball. You know what? I'm just gonna make one. We're gonna make one just so we're legit, you know? We want to have our own crystal ball. Wait, is that what moon it is in the overworld, I wonder? 
Well, regardless, we're just gonna go up here and make a crystal ball. All right, so. Uh, ooh, I forgot about this. Our little grimoire. Or book of, I forgot, whatever. <laughs> um, okay, so let's, hold on, actually. I feel like you forgot something. So we need lava. Oh, glass, I didn't even see that. Oh, crap. I didn't even notice. Wait, three glass. Oh, no. Oh, we have sand. Okay, one, two, three. There we go. And we do have extra lava, thank goodness. Okay, wait. So, let me get this lava. And... Oh, my inventory is so full. Let me put this stuff away. That we do not need. Um, This guy... And I'm gonna grab my purplicious cow, um, so he can give us some more some more buckets of lava, hopefully. And I'm also gonna put the quiver pet. He is out of juice. He's hungry. I'll also put the jukebox in here. Oh, I think the jukebox complained. He's hungry too. Everyone is freaking hungry. Gosh. Anyway, so. We need to put lava in here. There we go. And now, oh crap, there we go. Diamond on top, I think. Stone on the bottom. Glass all around. And that should do it. <gasps> Hooray! We have a crystal ball, everyone! Oh my gosh. So awesome. I think we probably already had one um, somewhere in a chest, but... You know what? I'm proud of myself for making it, for making it myself. I think you know that's more more legit. Oh, I forgot to put on my witch's hat. Dang it! I guess it wasn't legit. Damn it! It was all for nothing, guys. I'm a fake witch. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> yeah. Um. Uh, oh, where is? Oh, there you are, Amy. I was just thinking about you. I was like, where is Amy? Um. We still need to give you your second sibling. I actually totally forgot about that. Maybe we should do that today. Because I do have the egg, and we could make some more amethyst, a uh, bottle of amethyst. And I want to give Amy her second sibling, which is, well, first sibling. Yeah, first sibling, which is going to be, oh, what is this? Oh, oh yeah, I think I added, um, Hoss, Hoss, wait, Hostile Delight. Yeah, I added a few different, like, Farmer's uh, Delight add-ons. <laughs> anyway, look, I don't think that's a full moon. That That's a crescent moon, definitely. But, hey, let's try out the crystal ball before it turns nighttime. Or before, I mean, before it turns daytime. Anyway, what was I saying? So, yeah, uh, the second, or, no, ah, guys, I can't freaking speak today. The sec, the first, the first sibling that we're going to give to Amy is going to be Anthony. Not Anthony, it's Anthony. <laughs> so, well, Anthony would be the play on words because it's going to be an ant, but... We're gonna say Anthony. Um, anyway, how do you... How do you use it? Tell me. Tell me, crystal ball. Speak! Use the tell if it's day or night. And what phase of the moon cycle? Huh? I don't... How? I don't know how it works. Um, I think I might have to look- okay, well, it stopped raining now, of course, but I think I'm gonna have to look into the Book of Shadows and see. <sighs> Dang it. Yeah, I don't know how to use this crystal ball, actually. I probably should have just <sighs> read up on it in the book. Hopefully it says, though. So I'll go over- I'll go back and- actually, you know what? Before we go, I'm just gonna make the amethyst ant egg so that we can get that over with, too. Man, we were supposed to do coffee and tea today, but <laughs> distractions, distractions, man. Um, we still don't have any freaking, <laughs> actually, let me check actually if we have any. Uh, we have the coffee fruit from Kawaii Dishes. Did I have tea or did I make that up? I think I make, I think I imagined that. Uh, oh, no, look, we do have tea seeds. Okay. I think there's other types that we can get, though. So, 
we can just you know what let me just start with what i have already um first let's make the amethyst stuff so where is where's my amethyst huh where's all my amethyst is it in the fairy fairy grove perhaps okay first of all let me take melody out um okay i'm a little bit confused now where's my amethyst see this is what happens when i take too long on certain things oh yeah i think it's here yep okay yeah as i was saying this is what happens when i take too long with certain things i just completely forget <laughs> i lose all sense of what i was doing but yeah let's go back to the twilight forest and we should be able to make oh no we need to we need to brew the potions here we're gonna go back to the fairy grove and brew some potions, make the bottle of amethyst, and we can make our second ant egg. Oh, we need to probably give them both collar tags too. Hmm. Oh, we have some in here. Okay, cool. I'm still gonna brew another batch just so we have extras. Um, let me see. Do I have any glass? Hmm. We have a mana potion. I could just drink this. And then we can use this bottle and make another three batches. I'm getting random achievements. <laughs> okay, so we're gonna make three more after this one. Yay! This should be enough already, but, you know, I just want to make sure that we have enough because we still need to tame the ant afterwards. Why do I have a willow? Where did this come from? Where did this- huh? Where did I get my willow broom from? Well, it has a broom brush attachment. I could just maybe transfer it over here. Oh, I don't remember picking that up. I'm so confused. Okay, whatever. This is literally just a stick now. I'm just going to put this in here since that's kind of useless now. We're not going to be using that. But anyway, we have our bottle of amethyst. And now we can craft our amethyst and egg. Oh, wait. I think it's... <sighs> Things like this. Yay! Okay. We totally need to find another- Hi, Melody. <laughs> we need to find a new geode to actually um, get some more amethyst because we are running out. But yeah, let's go back to the Twilight Forest. Hello, Amy. Are you going to follow us? Come on, let's go back. We are going to hatch your sibling. I'm so excited. <laughs> oh my gosh. I love these little ants. Soon we're going to have a giant army of ants and i'm really excited for that so hopefully they'll follow us up here and teleport okay yay amy's here awesome and i forgot that i actually had muffin here too all right amy so here is gonna be your sibling please don't fall don't fall amy sit down even though you don't really listen to that command but let's see how long this guy takes to hatch come on Come on, Anthony, our little ant. Anthony the ant. Come on, you can hatch, buddy. Where's Melody? Where is she? Come on. Come on. Come on, come on, come on. I want to see the hatch, because last time my inventory was open. <gasps> Yay! Oh my gosh, awesome. Okay, let's tame him. Oh, that took so many. It was like four. Damn it. Okay, well, welcome to the family, Anthony. We totally need to name these two so we can not get them confused. But for now, I'm just gonna leave them kind of over here. And let's go check up on the Book of Shadows and see. Oh my god, what is going on? Why'd you do that? I did not... I did not need that. Okay, so we have to find... Oh my god, I'm not trying to open the freaking furnace. Um, where is it? The... Holy crap, this is annoying. Okay, here it is. Oh, what? The crystal ball is still a work in progress right now and acts as a decoration. You are a liar! This thing is a lie. It doesn't even say anything about 
telling the moon cycle. It says it's going to be used for either scrying or finding players or positions? What? I got totally scammed! This crystal ball is a freaking scam. Are you kidding me? I cannot believe this. <sighs> Fine. Have it your way. Have it your way, game. I'm just going to... Put this thing down. Freaking forget about it. Duh. You so- <gasps> Wait. Huh? But that looks like a sun. No? It was empty before. Why does it show a sun now? Okay, you know what? I'm gonna keep this on me. I have to- probably test this thing out again um i i'm done here right i don't think i i need anything else so let's go back to the overworld we can start working on the tea and coffee and we also give we gotta give marquita her bouquet i'm excited for that um and i want to test out this crystal ball because that was a sun that was not there before so i wonder I don't know. I don't know. I guess I'll have to see. So what happens if we place it down? Okay, now it's empty. What? Why is it empty in the overworld, but it has a sun in the twilight forest? That is so weird. What? I don't understand that at all. Also, Melody, like... Oh, hi, there you are. <laughs> I was so confused. Oh, I think I left her here. She probably didn't even go through the portal. Whoops. Anyway, um, okay, so I guess we'll just put this down. Mm, there. I don't know what to freaking expect out of that thing. But, yeah, we're still gonna have to wait for the full moon. Um, because I, I really want to make that moon thing. The moon brush. So, for now, um, let me put this amethyst in here. And let's give Marquita her bouquet. And I'm also going to grab the tea and coffee that we have from the chest. I'm going to still have to look for some of the other stuff. But for now, we can just start with what we have. Which is, oh, it's only one tea seed. That is kind of sad. But you know what? We can probably just bone meal it. Um, okay, first things first. Let's go find Marquita and see what she thinks. We're gonna pop the question, guys. <laughs> also, you may notice that the lighting got a little bit darker, which is because the sun is setting, but my light is on, so hopefully it's not too dark. Um, but again, cozy atmosphere. I don't want to blind you guys with any bright lights. Um, okay, so hi, Grover. How are you doing, bud? I don't feel like talking to you right now, so I'm just gonna let you go. Um, I want to find Marquita. Where is she? She's been hanging around near Stefan's place, kind of suspiciously often. See, she's still here. I guess she just likes to be with the people, you know? Maybe they're friends. Okay, so she's still overjoyed. That's her mood. So let's talk to her. Oh! You need to work? Well, fine. I guess. Ugh, I'll let you work. Whatever. <laughs> Where are you? Why are you even here? You're, if you're working, you're supposed to be at your home. Hi. Maybe I can talk to her again. Hey. <sighs> okay, she's in a bad mood, guys. Maybe we should wait until, you know, it's night. So she can come home. Marquita, come home. Come home, Marquita. I miss you. Ah, oh, getting emotionally attached to a Minecraft NPC is crazy! I'm just kidding. <laughs> but it is pretty fun. Okay, so... Um, I'm glad that Eric and uh, Grover are still alive, though. That's pretty That's pretty good. It seems like they're, they're safer off in the village anyway. Um, which is a good thing, so... Yeah. But, I mean, Marquita has her whole-ass house here, so I feel like she should also be pretty safe. So 
so hopefully she will teleport here. Hi! I mean, the sun is set. She's still not here. <sighs> Where is she? Where? Where is Marquita? Marquita, come home, please. My gosh, do I have to drag her home? Let's kill the spider. Oh, that was a one shot. Damn. Okay, uh, I guess she is. I don't know where she is. She's still over there? Yeah, she is. Why are you not home, girl? Why are you not home? Is she coming home? I'm just gonna follow her. Where are you going? Oh, she wants a. Oh, wait, no, that's Melody. Oh, come on. Are you walking home? Where are you going, huh? I need to show you something. You know what? Follow me, Marquita. I'm gonna take you to the butterfly garden. I wanna show you something. Come on, Melody, please. Get out of the way. Come here. Okay, Marquita. Well, oh, <laughs> come. So this, I don't know if you've ever been here before, but this is the butterfly garden and I'm still trying to get some new butterflies in here. I haven't really seen any. Uh, anyway, <laughs> I wanted to um, give you this bouquet and see if you were interested. <laughs> Um, okay, she's like not in the mood to talk, but hopefully, you know, it's fine. I'm just gonna get for this. <gasps> she feels the same way! Oh, that is so sweet. Okay. Hi. So now, she's in love with Love Star. <laughs> get it? Love Star? Okay. <laughs> not funny. So, I guess now we are officially together, which is awesome. So, uh, I'm going to hug her. <gasps> Oh, she was receptive to that, which is good. Sometimes they're a little bit pissy when you try to be affectionate. Um, okay, she really wants to work. Girl, it's nighttime. You're supposed to be sleeping. By this evening, it's already nighttime. Okay, you know what? I'm taking you home. Come on. You need to stop working yourself to death. This is ridiculous. You're like me. <laughs> Just working all day. Not good for your health. Not good. Let's go home, and you need to get yourself to sleep. Okay, Marquita. Did you even notice that your cat has a name now? You should stay here. Oh, she's looking at the cat. Oh, it's your cat. That's your cat. Let me talk to her. Let's tell a joke. Ah, oh, she found it funny. Okay. Um, yeah, you do need all the rest you can get, so you can go cuddle with your cat. Um... So, let's actually, let's go sleep ourselves, and I'm gonna see if this thing is gonna... <sighs> what the heck? Yeah. yeah, it's not, it's not showing anything. I don't understand how this is supposed to work. Maybe I'm missing something. <sighs> Hi, Eric. What are you doing here? Okay, let's go sleep. Yay. Okay, so... Now we can start working on some of the coffee and tea stuff. So first I need to plant my little crops because we need to start growing those as soon as possible. So let me just make sure that I actually have some bone meal. Yes, we do. Okay, cool. So we can just duplicate a little bit of that stuff. And let me also not forget to place this back. Put it here. There you go. There's a zombie. I don't care. Okay, let's go to the path. This is so- oh my god! Oh, you're scared of me? Wait, why? Why did I run away? Creeper? Creeper? Oh! Wait, why is it scared? Why are you scared of me? Oh, 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 oh. I'm scared. Why is it scared? Did I forget about something? What- am I wearing something? No. I don't know why it was scared of me. That's weird. Huh. It's a bizarre little scaredy creeper. <laughs> anyway. Okay, so yeah, let's go plant our crops. And while they're growing, 
Um, you know what I kind of want to put around here? A little, um... What's it called? Like a little hedge? Um... Hedge... Wall. Like a hedge fence or something. Whatever. Um, but first, let me plant the crops. So we're just gonna make a little small space for this. For now. And... This should be enough for now. And I'm gonna place the tea on this side. Oh, wait. Um, how do you grow this? Oh, it's a bush. Okay. So, wait. And then does this grow? Huh. I guess it grows on either. Well, I'm gonna place the coffee here then. Like this. And the tea, I'll- I guess I'll just grow it here. Let me flatten out a little area. Yeah, we'll put the tea bush right there. So now we should be able to bone meal this. Oh, no, we can't. God dang it. <laughs> okay, I guess we'll have to let it grow. At least we have one, so we can at least get this process started on. And I want to see, do I have any slabs? Yes, I do. Okay, wait, I'm actually going to use this spruce trap door. Cover up the water. And... We can also maybe put these glowberries. <gasps> Why did it do that? Oh man! Why would it do that? It took two of my glowberries. Well, whatever. Yeah, because I want to put some of them just around here. I don't like that it does that. Stop. Ah, <sighs> what the heck? Wait! What happened to all my glowberries? What is going on? Wait, so I have ten. That uses up two confused whatever let me get rid of this it's annoying put another one there ah oh, i don't like that stop okay i guess we'll leave it at that and now i need to get some leaves so let me let me go get some really quick oh my god i'm cutting down some trees and there's a mushroom girl in a tree i think she must have been stuck there oh my god let me free you you're like a little cat stuck in a tree there you go <laughs> I wanted to get some saplings, I just saw that. <laughs> that was so funny. Okay, you're free to go now. But yeah, anyway, so Melody, I need those saplings, thank you very much. So I'm gonna plant some of these trees around the tea house, maybe more actually in the back, um, so we can get a little bit of privacy. Not like we're growing anything illegal, right? <laughs> but just so, you know, it's a little bit more secluded and quiet. And now we can plant these leaves and create a little tiny melody. You are in the freaking way. Move. We can make a tiny little separation here. And um, it'll be kind of like our little leaf wall from our fairy forest. So yeah, something, something like this. Very simple. Um, I like that. It's really cute actually. Very, very cozy. Oh, look, the tea is growing a little bit. Um, can I bone you? No. Okay, I think it needs to grow one more until it gets, like, brown in color. Um, so this area, I guess, will be where we're gonna put the tea bushes. Um, so let me block up this stuff. Yeah. Melody! Move! Thank you. Okay. So, let's see what we can craft now because we do have some stuff from the respite mod that i want to make first things first i think we're going to need to make a um a kettle so copper bucket leather and sticks should be pretty easy and i'm pretty sure this needs to be lit on top of a cooking no no, no a stove a stove requires it like i think it needs like bricks and something else i think a campfire so we're gonna have to make those two things and then probably some other stuff from Kawaii Dishes. Um, but we'll see. And you know what? I'm gonna take Spook. Oh, Magicora is still here too. Okay. You know what? I'll just take Magicora with me. You know what? We'll just have a little party. Party with us today. Let's get a little bit crunk. I'm sorry. <laughs> anyway. So let me see. I need to make a new stove. Uh, let me make the kettle first though. So we need copper. And leather. And we have sticks. So I think that's everything. 
Yay, awesome. Okay. And let me put away the leaves. Don't need this. We don't need the gunpowder. Oh, E. Alright. Um, now for the stove. We're gonna need bricks, iron ingots, and a campfire. So we should have some bricks. Uh, we need- oh god, do we actually have enough? Oh yes, we do. Okay, good, good. Did not want to get some of those. Um, campfire. We need logs for that, which I should have some in here. Missing coal. Okay, there we go. Now the stove. Awesome! So I think that's the only thing we need from the respite mod. So let me check on kawaii dishes. Yeah, this one requires a lot of different things. We can start by maybe making the coffee press since we are growing coffee. Okay, so this is pretty easy. Just some iron ingots and stained glass panes or any glass paint. I'm just going to make some regular ones because I don't want to waste my white ones. So it was like this. There we go. Okay. Coolio! <laughs> the ye olden ways. <laughs> okay, I've used a coffee press before. It's pretty fun, actually. Well, I used a French press. I don't know if there's an actual difference. I'm pretty sure there is, but... Okay. Anyway, uh, I want to do this in the uh, I mean, in the daytime, so let's go sleep really quick. And you know what? I'm gonna, I'm gonna talk to Marquita, actually. I'm gonna sleep in her bed, because why not? Um... Let's just kill two birds with one stone. So how are you doing? She's still hanging out with the kitty. You st you really like Gem, don't you? Anyway, I'm gonna just use your bed really quick if you don't mind. All right, let's go. Oh, wait, don't grow any freaking tall grass. Let's go back and plant down our new machinery. Ha ha ha. I'm so excited to learn all of these new little contraptions. Okay, so first we're gonna need to actually make a little bit of a counter space. I'm gonna use the spruce logs and we're just gonna make little area here and we're gonna put the stove right here in the middle boom and the kettle goes on top oh so awesome look how cute that is oh my gosh do you guys use a kettle um, when you make your tea I usually boil my tea either just like in a little infuser or in uh, in a pot but I, I like using kettles at least to warm up the water. Anyway, random side tangent. This is cute. This actually does look like a French press. Well, except for mine is metal and not glass. But anyway, I don't know how to use this. There's no... Oh, didn't mean to make you stay. There's no interface. So that's a little bit weird. Uh, what else can we make? Coffee machine. Ooh, we need to use the French press to actually make this. Um, uh, We can also easily make that. So I guess we'll just... Yeah, we'll make our French press into the coffee machine. I feel like that's going to be more useful anyway. I don't know what this thing does. Or maybe it's supposed to be used specifically for the coffee machine? I don't know. But yeah, now I'm going to have to go back and get some redstone. Alright, I'm back with all of my things. And now we should be able to make the coffee machine. There we go. An espresso, please. Ooh, cute! Actually, this probably should be placed on the other side. So let's put this here. <laughs> We're... Of course, Magigora is conveniently stepping on. Alright, so... Oh, that looks so cute! Um, let's... Hmm, I don't know how to use this. We probably need to make some... Oh, that requires bricks. I do not want to do that! Okay, let's check up on the tea. <gasps> Wait, is this ready to be harvested? <gasps> Yay! Awesome! Okay, so now we have two seeds, so we can just... Wait, there we go. And we got three black tea leaves. Okay, awesome. Let's see what we can do with this. So maybe we can brew a cup of tea? Let's go back to the respite mod and see what we can do with the tea. <gasps> oh my gosh, wait. So, okay, we can make dandelion tea with a dandelion and black tea. Well, I prefer black tea, so I'm gonna make this. And we're gonna need a glass bottle, which I don't have. Great. Um, yeah, I guess I'm gonna have to make some- you know what we should also do? I, I probably should make like a cupboard or a few, so I'm also gonna make those really quick. 
Okay guys, so I just made a bunch of furniture items that I think will fit in our little tea house here. So first things first, I'm actually going to replace this and put these countertops. The wood color- oh crap. <laughs> the wood color doesn't match 100% but I think it's still pretty nice looking. And of course, something freaking trampled my crops here, dang it. Um... Yeah, no, they, they actually look really pretty, actually. So, then I'm gonna place these little... What's it called? Cabinets. Okay, so yeah, definitely not not um, not very matchy, but they're pretty cute. So, uh, I'm gonna fill in this space with some spruce logs. It's pretty cute, actually. Like, I, I, I kind of like the mismatch. You know, it's kind of interesting. Add some some interest uh and then over here we're gonna make another space i'm gonna put the oven and i guess more of the countertops we'll put two there so we'll have like kind of like a little tiny island and we'll make this go around cute oh my god that is so pretty and then on this side we're gonna have a little hmm where should i put this actually maybe here We'll put the little table. I made two chairs, so we'll put the chairs here. Does that work? I don't I don't think I like that. It's kinda awkward looking. Uh maybe yeah, maybe on this side will make more sense. So we'll put the chairs here. Oh, that's so cute. So we can sit here and drink our tea, which is actually gonna start brewing now. Uh what am I missing? What the heck? Um How do you... Why is this not brewing? What is this? Do we need like water? Oh, no water. Um, how do I... How do I give water? Huh? Oh! Did that work? Yay! Oh, that's really cute! I like that we had to actually fill in the water. That's really nice. Okay, this totally needs a carpet. I don't have any carpet though. Um, uh, maybe... <sighs> what the frick is you doing, Spook? We'll make some carpet. Here we go. Yes! Okay. I'm so glad that we can make this moss carpet um, really easily. So we're just gonna put this here and add a little bit of color to our space. Oh, it looks so cute! I love this! And I'm actually gonna test this out by moving the chairs right here. So... Uh, they're kind of a little bit more out of the way. I think I need to just make another pair of chairs. <gasps> oh my god, what? Hello? Magicora, what happened? Holy crap. Melody. What? Did you girls fight? What just happened? <gasps> oh my god. Wait, did they step in the sweet berries? Oh my gosh, Magicora. I thought you were going to beat up Melody. Jesus. Okay. You need to stay here and you need to sit down. Spook, I guess you're chill. Um, okay, sorry, black tea is ready. This is the worst possible time to be drinking black tea, but I'm gonna drink. Mmm, delicious! And we got an effect. We got caffeinated, which I guess gives us a speed boost. But yeah, so that was actually really fun. Um, there's not really much else we can make at the moment because we don't have any of the other uh, types of leaves. We need yellow tea leaves green tea leaves, rose hips. Oh my gosh. Yeah, we need some other ingredients here, but coffee berries. Hmm. We can also find coffee beans somewhere. I don't I don't even know where to find them. But yeah, I need to look into this mod a little bit and see where I can find all the other stuff, but we could make this purulent tea um with fermented spider eye and netherwort. Oh, that's not a good tea. What? That gives us a weakness. I don't want to make that. Okay. Um, well, we made some tea. And we're going to harvest my, my little coffee fruits here. Cute! Awesome! So maybe we can make... I don't know, can we make coffee? How do I... How do I use the coffee beans? Um... Ooh, okay, so we have to dry them first. And then I think we have to roast them. Yes, okay. So we're gonna need to make ourselves a smoker, I suppose. 
yeah um okay let's see if i can make a smoker so first we need a furnace and some logs there we go got ourselves a smoker that i can oh wait the oven is this is a smoker isn't it yeah okay so that was ridiculous i did not need to do that but i guess we can place it elsewhere we'll just save it for later um but yeah so now we can try our coffee beans cool i guess we could technically just use this but uh where where can i put that <laughs> without it being like super awkward um i guess we can just put this here for now and we can start drying i mean roasting the beans while they're drying so do two things at once and all right so now let's see if we can make some coffee um, so, oh, in the blender we need to make coffee powder. Okay, I will do this, I will do this. Let's make the blender. Okay, we're gonna need some panes, which uh, I need to go back to the house. Guys, there's extra tea seeds in here. I don't remember having that. Well, I'm gonna take those and grow them, and I'm gonna take this coffee fruit too. Wow, I did not know I had extra. That's crazy. All right, I'm back and now we should be able to make the blender. There we go. So, okay, I do not want to put it there. <laughs> Let me move this to, we'll put it here. And now we should be able to blend this, cool. Let's also put this to roast. Roasting coffee beans, this is so awesome. I'm actually thoroughly enjoying this. Okay, let's, oh, can we only do one at a time? What? Boo, that's lame. Okay. So after we have the coffee powder, what can we do? We can make doppio coffee, macchiato with sugar and milk. Okay, well, let's just make the simplest one for now because I don't have any of this other stuff with me, but I can make the doppio. So we're going to need some water and two coffee powder, which luckily we do have enough for. So I'm going to keep roasting, I mean, uh, grinding those. And so we need, oh, wait, hold on. I need a freaking cup don't I yeah we're gonna need to make a mug so I'm gonna have to grab some bricks really quick okay I made a mug hopefully this is reusable because uh, I do not want to keep making these um, but now we should be able to make the doppio so we need water right on the left so let me put this here and then like this and then where do I put the mug? Here? I think this is gonna give us the doppio. <gasps> Yay! Oh wait, that gave us an espresso. What? Hmm. Interesting. How do I make espresso? Wait, but I used two, didn't I? That's weird. Oh well. I guess it doesn't matter, we have an espresso coffee. So I'm gonna drink this again at nighttime. The worst time to drink coffee, and that's a that's a new moon right there. Okay, so it's a new moon. Um, I guess we have to keep on waiting for the full moon. But let's drink! Yippee! Oh, we got some night fishing. And the kawaii effect, which I do not know what that does, actually. But we got our mug back, and we can place it down. But yeah, I think I'm going to go ahead and end this episode here, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. It was very cozy and comforting, and I really enjoyed growing the coffee and making the tea and making the the coffee that was really fun i like really enjoyed that um so i'm excited to keep working on it and finding the other types of tea leaves and stuff but yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this episode let me know what you think i should do next i'm actually going to be working i'm actually planning on going to start the feywild stuff really soon so probably next episode we're gonna start digging into the feywild mod so i'm really excited for that stay tuned and be sure to check out my youtube memberships if you want to see these episodes early and a bunch of other perks including my members exclusive let's play and with that being said guys i hope you have a great day and i will see you all next time bye thank you to all of my youtube members for supporting my content and especially katiana nowhere clara dorby cheyenne and eros for becoming star members